chug, 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 chug. This week's Drink of the Week segment is brought to you by having bad friends that make you want to get a drink. In this instance, <laughs> I have a co-host that makes me want to have a drink. So <laughs> this week, consistently every week. This, this week we will be reviewing the spring. Hey, Steve, put your can down, Steve. <laughs> work oh, I got the hologram. <laughs> that's, the, that's the green screen effect. Look at that. But uh, we'll be doing the Spring House Brewing Company Daily Planet. It is a hazy. IPA, man, we are on. Never want to add We are six uh, percent alcohol. Um, you know, I guess you get the the Galactus vibes uh, from yeah. comic books and and that. Now um, to be confused with Daily Planet. It's so it is. It says that it is uh, tropical ah, notes of citrus and pine. That. <laughs> <laughs> and it's brewed out of Lancaster, PA. So. Shout out Lancaster. 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 <laughs> it's the yinzer in you. That's the yinzer in me for sure. Yeah, I can't Woo! I can't see it with the green screen. <laughs> <laughs> so. All right. So we, we we've had this run of IPAs here. And for an IPA non drinker, this has been uh, maybe a rough stretch, but um, we'll we'll take a sip here, see what we think. And it's citrus. Notes of citrus and pine. That the last time I tasted pine is something I was like fourteen drinking Tangare, and that was not pine. that good. Your pick. You're the pick that. You're pick. <laughs> you picked I it for the label. Yeah. <laughs> it can definitely smell oh, the hops. Man, this IPA be jumping. <laughs> I'm I'm actually not mad at this. I'm mad at it. <laughs> I say out of the IPAs that we've done here recently, I would put this at number two behind uh, Stone Cold's Broken Skull. Oh, that was so good. <laughs> yeah. His hops aren't aggressive. These hops are a little aggressive in this beer. Oh, but I don't think it's it, it's nearly as overpowering as some of the other IPAs that we've done. <laughs> I'm here being marks. <laughs> hey, I said on that episode, the Broken Skull IPA is the IPA that got me interested Ooh, in IPAs. That was good. That was good. I don't think I'll ever be, I, I don't think I will ever truly become an IPA drinker. It's just not for mm. me. Like, no. you know, we'll, we'll review IPAs because, you know, we'll we'll break down and, and drink what we decide to pick out. But if I'm ever out in a setting somewhere, I, I don't think I'm ever going to be that guy to go to a bar and order an IPA. It's no. not going to yeah. happen. Mm-hmm. Um, I stick with the I'll stick with the wheat beers. I'll stick with you know the stouts. Um, that'll that'll be more more my style of, of beer. But I say for an IPA for this, being pleasantly surprised, I'll, I'll give it a I'll give it a solid three out of five on the sumo scale because I picked it. I'm gonna go with a two. <laughs> Have you picked anything over a three? <clears throat> Beer wise? No. No. Well, last got, week was got, a three, wasn't it? I think so. No, the goss, that was the worst thing ever. Mm-hmm. That's well, yeah. Well, so, yeah. That, that was bad. <laughs> I'll, so um, Jay- Jason's a fan of beer. sours, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> I'll go with a three on this. Chris? Yeah, I, got, I got a couple cans yeah. left. Of, uh, <laughs> <laughs> no. Nope. Um, it's it's not a terrible IPA. It's definitely a mediocre IPA. Um, the, nothing. I don't really taste anything special. As I said, the hops are a little aggressive. I'm gonna go 1.5. Sounds like an EW match. <laughs> All right, well, to, uh, <laughs> that's this week's drink of the week, uh, the Springhouse Brewing Company's Daily Planet. Uh, again, don't don't just judge your 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 feelings on these beers based off of our recommendations. Again, if you love IPAs, I think this would be one that you would actually enjoy a lot. Um, but we're you know most of us here on this show aren't really fans of it. The can itself is a cool can. Yeah, uh, that's why that's why it was picked to be reviewed. So, uh, with all that being said, <laughs> judge um, a book by its cover. 
In this instance, it was a terrible book. So hold up your <laughs> bottles, cans, shot glasses, brown paper bags, solo cups, <laughs> and to good ships and wood ships and ships that sail the seas. But the best ships are friendships, and friends will always be.